this is a plant that is a very noxious weed. Uh, I don't even know the scientific name, but it grows in our gardens, it grows in the pastures, it's very hard to kill, and when you do try to pull it, it puts stickers all over in your hands. Uh, it's very distinctive. It has this sage green colored uh, vegetation, and it has kind of a leaf that is somewhat uh, you know, serrated on the edges. You can see what I'm talking about. And it has this beautiful purple flower with a yellow stamen. But like I said, it's a noxious weed and it uh, and multiplies quickly. And the farmers call it jackass weed because it happens to be so stubborn that they can't get rid of it. But when it goes to seed, when those flowers go to seed, it makes a little yellow ball. And uh, where every one of these flowers are, there's going to be these little yellow balls and if you try to burn the weed then uh, it, those balls just explode and scatter seed all over but it has also got a very useful purpose and that is if you'll pick the in the fall if you'll pick the yellow uh, ball of uh, seed crush it and pour boiling water over it leave it to steep for a couple hours <clears throat> and then strain it through a cheesecloth and bring it tight. It uh, makes a yellow liquid that is uh, rennet and that's what you use for cheese making and that's what the uh, Spanish <coughs> people and the uh, Native American people would make their cheese with before you could buy rennet in the stores. So even noxious weeds have helpful purposes at times. <laughs>